Welcome back to Let's Play Overlord. It's become the 17th of May 1944. Um, Norway's National Day. Hooray! <laughs> and let's hit the Ops Room. See what's kicking. A road mission. Issued. Q doesn't seem to need us anymore. Um. Which means get to plan our own route. Um, defense activity is out of control. Air activity is out of control though. Well, not that high because we keep shooting down those enemy planes. Concentrate on mech transport. Small washing yards are under control. So large marshalling yards. Bridges. So yeah, I think uh, defenses are probably the biggest thing here. But we have knocked out several radar stations. But no coast. Why? Well, yeah, only one coastal battery. Unfortunately, that. I fear going for more coastal batteries. And I think we, I uh, think a simple fighter can't really do very much about that. We might be able to hurt the radar stations though. This one, northwest of Cherbourg, right. We have knocked out the Signal service station quite close to Sherbo, so... But this one, Avamage. Northwest of Car. Detect shipping and gun ranging. Also capable of aircraft detection. Then there's Cup d'Antifer. Where is it? Can't don't fit. North of Le Havre. So there's one north of Le Havre that we haven't hit. There's one northwest of Car that we haven't hit. And then there's Car radar station itself, just north of Car. Sounds like Car itself would be um Good target, since also there's an air, uh, airport there. An airfield that we haven't really hit very hard. So we want to get to car. Um. Huh? Across the coast of car, turn back from Argentina. Oh, I don't think we're going to fly that far in land to be, land, to be honest. But, uh, In fact, I think uh, we might. Oh, we're going to start a car, but but we're far from car to have. Fighter and bombers, rail traffic. Two flights of Mustangs and now Escort and only cannons. And then here comes the Luftwaffe. We better hit the air raid shelter. And then fly. Okay, there are some enemies over there. Car itself is over there. Whoa! Something's firing at us. Um, northwest of 
car that would probably mean more or less in the area where those enemy fighters are, does it? I think they might be coming this way actually. So I don't want to give them an easy attack on R6, so it's going to turn this into a head-on. There they are. And we stopped up. Barrel rolled around to try and avoid that head-on, and now we're in more of a turning fight. It's still coming pretty head-on, but I'm going to Right now. And the other way now. Well, that was. Just the other way again. Probably his wings trying to sneak up on my tail while I'm doing that. Don't know what those boom sounds there are. And that was the first hit I scored on them, but I only grazed them. an overshoot. But I managed to get myself out of that position. I mean, his plane's been pretty badly injured. There he goes. One pass by my wing and he's down. So, where's his wing? Oh, far away. 13 miles. Alright. Cars over that. I think what we have over there is the airfield. Are there any ground targets? Yeah, there's actually a ground target pretty close by. Let's head for that one. It looks like it might be out in the open, which means it might be tanks or transports, and that was what we were supposed to focus on, to be honest. Um, tanks because of their defense, and mechanical transport because that's sort of transport things that are kind of priority targets now that I haven't taken out that many of, oh, because you know, that looks a lot like neck transport to me. Okay, those bandits are still quite far away. So should have plenty of time for another turn on those transports. that's gonna save me speed which might be good when those fighters show up but makes the attack run on these ground things themselves a bit more tricky Get him. There's one left, I think. These fighters are very, very close now, though. Well, not, not actually back those seven miles. Still got time for one more pass. Have I got ammo for one more pass and then fight, fighting the fighters? I got him, and now 
I've got to turn around and face those uh, fighters, I think. What am I doing for ammo? Oh, not too great, but... This is the guy who's headed straight for me, and I'm not gonna. There's no point wasting ammo uh, trying to hit him in the head on, rather try and roll. So he doesn't get a shot on me. Hold my fire until I can get a clearer shot on him. I hope his wingman isn't climbing onto my tail right now. But this has got free camera, so with any luck. Mites. Oh, that was just a silly mess. I knew I wasn't going to hit there. That was a waste of ammo, basically. Doing all kinds of away evasive maneuvers. Shooting below him, I think. He's turning the other way. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, he's pretty good at trying to evade me. I'm going to need to make another turn. Something of a low yo-yo there. Oh, again, a good deal of speed, so now I'm getting on. Yep, I had a clear shot. Of course, I'm sort of falling now, mate. Mm, actually, though... Alright, it's not too bad. Um, thing is... His friend seems to be gone, so presumably my wingman got him. What am I doing for ammo? 60 rounds left. That's obviously not a lot, but it's a little bit. Car is down there. Clearly the air airfield is that's car airfield is over there. And there's some radar stations nearby. Now, I get this feeling those buildings seem pretty badly damaged to me. Building over there that seems to be alright there. Attack on that building. Oh, I'm still flying on external fuel tanks. <laughs> no wonder my plane was handling a wee bit sluggishly in that dogfight. Oh, that wasted a lot of cannon ammo, but it did at least blow up that building in the end, I think. What else? Ah, uh, the uh, the AA is opening up on me. There's a hangar over here, though. I'm going to try and take some pot shots at that one. Alright. Still not. And it's around. That's car. There are some ground targets over there, but that's could be shipping. What's that thing over there, though? Is that a V1 launching site, or actually a radar station, or maybe a coastal battery?
short. Let's get up over it a little bit. So we're talking about 11 o'clock. We'll be over there. And we are back. Uh, right. What is this anyway? Is that? Actually, this looks like it. This is a rocket launching site, is what it is. Well. V1 rocket launching site. It looked like one round of cannon ammo did some damage to it at least. And, uh, what? No targets? Seriously? Oh! No! Don't crash on me! Tends to do that, doesn't it, when I go... Damn it. Close... Close camera version of a ground target always crashes. I should have learned that by now.